Hi everybody, Iggy here today and I want to share with you guys that these videos, they probably take me about 30 to 45 minutes depending on mostly editing. I do the audio first and I want to make I want to make a live version, kind of like a podcast where I just go off um, with the ideas in, that are going around in my head um, for the show and also the new shows that I'm going to be creating. I had a great idea while I was I was jogging today in the morning. Uh, I got excited with this new idea, and it's because uh, recently, if you've noticed, I've made a video or two with my niece and nephew, uh, Layla and Isaiah. And Layla, Layla approached me, and she said, "Hey, can we see how you make your videos?" Kind of uh, just wondering how I do it, and you know, a part of them was thinking, like, "Man, I would love to be able to do something like that." And I said, "Yeah, let's just uh, let's let's just make one right now." And that's how we did the first video where I introduced Layla. It took us about maybe like 10 uh, little intros because she was really shy, but I know she's just a rock star inside and she naturally just firecracker out. And today I had a great idea and I was thinking to myself, how, what can we do? Uh, what can I, how can I spend my time with them? So if we do make a video or a channel for them, it's something worthwhile. I mean, we could, as you notice now that we have, there's YouTube videos where people unboxing they unbox, you know, toys and stuff. And, or, you know, you could go to different places like amazing places like Disneyland. That requires a lot of money and it kind of builds like this, not only, but this, one thing I think about these places is it builds like this incessant need for entertainment. And I'm slightly against that personally because I feel like if you're an interesting enough person, if you're curious enough of, of the world, you can be fascinated with the simplest things. For example, if we were to be next to an entomologist, somebody who studies bugs, merely being in a field, in a soccer field, they could find a roly-poly and tell us so much about it and it would blow our mind and we would just be like, wow, we could totally make a show about that and just our mind would go you know, on a tangent just talking about bugs and all this stuff, and I think it's not that we're, the, it's boring. Or the, our cir- circumstance is not boring. You could be at Disneyland, you could be bored. I think it's not the problem. We're the problem. We are bombarded with all this garbage. People watch. People nowadays are watching so much TV uh, that, or they're just on our. We're on our phone so much, and I'm guilty of it too. I'm not saying that I'm, you know. Mm-hmm. I'm not a, I'm not, I am a part of it, Uh, I'm affected by it, I'm not immune to it, but um, it's just that this revolves around our life so much that how can we become more interesting as as individuals and be more curious. If there's something I want to I want to pass on to my niece and nephew is, uh, I guess, curiosity. And this will lead to the channel. I'll tell you guys my vision for our channel. Curiosity, I would love to pass on, um, you know, uh, confidence. And uh, also vision, be able to have a vision and get excited about something. A kind of like resilience or stubbornness. For their uh, for their vision, something great that goes hand in hand with great leadership, and also I would like to pass on um, empathy for others, and what else? Um, what else? Uh, there's another one on here. I think uh, make a difference. You know, make a difference is, is uh, I would say, be a cat. Ooh, there you go. There's a cute word. A catalyst of change for the better. For the better. Uh, that we can do something, you know. Even with whatever medium we choose to use, say if we happen to go on YouTube, that we're not merely going on YouTube to make videos about sticking our fingers in putty making fart noises and even though we can get like a million views we rather have you know one view if it changes somebody's life or it makes somebody learn something so we want to have better uh, principles 
uh, and and hopefully influence other people to um, to see this way because I feel like a great leader can um, can give other people the the curiosity and the vision to want to aspire for for a greater cause and let me get into the idea I have um, as I was running this morning God, running is doing such a great thing for my mind right now it's awesome it's much better it's this my favorite thing a sheet of paper this is a beautiful 96 uh, I think it's percent brightness 20 pound uh, Oof, just paper. I love this paper with a this is I'm using my utensil writing utensil here is a pilot G2 number 10 bold. Oh, it's gorgeous. Beautiful. I just have to these are my tools right here. These are my tools. Um brightness, pound, this is like the weight, thickness or whatever. Uh but either way, let me go back to what I was talking about is that I want to start a channel with them, a YouTube channel to make them much more interesting people and myself and to be okay with with um with we are we are being okay and confident with our ignorance. We don't know anything, and to know that, um, also appreciate others for what they know. Everybody we meet knows something we don't. Um, so that goes along with curiosity, and also uh, be and in, in, get people involved. Involve others. Get other people involved this process. So this idea, I just realized, encompasses so much that I, I can't wait to share this with them and sell this vision to them and myself. I'm already sold on it. Let me just tell you guys about it. So my idea was that I want to go out with them and take them out on little trips. It could be anywhere. Uh, we could be, you know, in a grass field. We could be uh, out in a new city. And we just become curious as if we landed, say, if we're from Mars which actually in their lifetime, in a couple of years, in about a decade or less, we're going to be sending people over there because of NASA and SpaceX. Um, but either way, say if we were from, if uh, hypothetically from Mars and we were to fly over here to Earth, um, what would we want to know? And give them that, that curiosity to go around and the example I imagine is like kind of our cell phones is like this Pokedex of like, which will happen sooner or later. It will be like an artificial intelligence where we scan a plant and tells us everything about it. But for now, we can just make a YouTube video and ask people actually on the video, hey guys, to the audience. I have a lot of faith in the community of knowledge of the internet and the people within it. It could be friends. It could be uh, family that get involved. It could be community, you know, our community, our city. It could be a, oh, I don't know if I'm spelling that right. And it could be the whole, you know, world, the World Wide Web, the WW. It could be the whole world that, you know, have a vested interest in our understanding of the earth, of the world, of everything around us. And by making a YouTube channel, a YouTube channel that um, we get to ask questions as explorers and make it fun. I can't wait to see what the intro is uh, going to look like. I'm going to make a little cute little intro, get something for them just to make it a little more, um, a little fancy and exciting, a little cute song. And we'll go out and edit it together and go everywhere and just be curious and ask questions about everything. We could talk about, you know, we can ask about a, a you know, a roly poly and maybe so, maybe like we get a response maybe not right away but we'll get a response from like a entomologist this week thinking about that earlier is they tell us some great facts about it you know all these great things about this and we don't know or we go up to um we go on a hike and we zoom in on plants and we're like what is this thing what is this plant and find out that it has all these like medicinal qualities and i know there's like these field guide these books out there um, but I, I want to I want us to get involved and to be okay to ask questions to the world and, and, and see what happens and leave it open-ended people might respond or might not but over time I think we could build a following if we just stick to our ideals stick to our vision and um, be resilient about it and I th also I'm sure there's books about you know uh, flora and fauna 
think that's the word, about like all kinds of animals and stuff around us. But um, it'd be exciting for them to go on this process together. And I feel like that's a good way for me to spend time with them. Like, like I said, I don't want to make a channel about, you know, us doing dorky stuff on there. I mean, we always have that option. We get more probably followed, but it's something that we can be passionate and grow together. And yeah, I think that's it. Just uh, I, the way I look at it is I would go out with them and take them out anywhere and just build um, something together. Like, um, yeah. Just a, a vision. We have a vision that um, of this platform where we all uh, where we all learn together and 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 share this. And I'm really excited, even though I don't sound like it. I'm really tired. It was a long day, but I'm glad I made this video because I want to have a video where I can just be more of like a what's in my mind uh, off the wall, off the, just talking about how I, what I'm thinking, and, um, yeah, I oh, just have time for a breather and not have to edit this video at all uh, when I have a busy day, like I'm tired right now, I don't sound the same as my other videos, I know it's going to be longer, and um, just be myself, and, um, yeah, oh, this feels good, I'm just, oh, I'm ready to, that, that's it guys, uh, thank you so much for watching, I would appreciate any comment that you guys could leave for ideas for the name of our show, um, obviously it's Layla and Isaiah, you know, I'm Iggy, I'll probably be involved, I'll be curating their, creating their videos, and we'll go out there and, and, and explore the world, and hopefully get some feedback, and I would appreciate you guys, I'm going to probably make the first video something simple that you guys can get involved with and help us learn about something that's pretty common knowledge, uh, just to get the ball rolling, and, and if you have any ideas on how we can get other people to respond to our increase of our sense of curiosity on this video, let me let us in the comments below. Uh